The Amur River even, Tamur Tamur, Russian, Reka Amur IPA, Mur or Hailong Zhang Chinese, Heilong Zhang Pinyin, Heilong Zhang, Black Dragon River, Manchu, Er, Mollendorf, Sahalian Ula, Heling Jiang, Abkai, Sahalian Ula, Heling Jiang, Black Water, is the world's tenth longest river, forming the border between the Russian Far East and Northeastern China Inner Manchuria. The largest fish species in the Amur is the Kaluga, attaining a length as great as 5.6 meters 18 feet. The Amur River is the only river in the world in which subtropical Asian fish such as snakehead, coexist with Arctic Siberian fish, such as pike. The river is home to a variety of other large predatory fish such as taimen, Amur catfish, and yellowcheek. Name Historically, it was common to refer to a river simply as water. The word for water is similar in a number of Asiatic languages, mul, mul in Korean, muran moron in Mongolian, and mizu, mizu in Japanese. The name Amur may have evolved from a root word for water, coupled with a size modifier for big water. The Chinese name for the river, Hailong Zhang, means Black Dragon River in Chinese, and its Mongolian name, Kar Moran Cyrillic, Har Mern means Black River. Course The river rises in the hills in the western part of northeast China at the confluence of its two major affluents, the Shilka River and the Ergun or Argon River, at an elevation of 303 meters (994 feet). It flows east, forming the border between China and Russia, and slowly makes a great arc to the southeast for about 400 kilometers (250 miles), receiving many tributaries and passing many small towns. At Huma, it is joined by a major tributary, the Huma River. Afterwards it continues to flow south until between the cities of Blagovshinsk Russia and Heihe China. it widens significantly as it is joined by the Ziya River, one of its most important tributaries. The Amur arcs to the east and turns southeast again at the confluence with the Berea River, then does not receive another significant tributary for nearly 250 kilometers 160 miles before its confluence with its largest tributary, the Songhua River, at Tongjiang. At the confluence with the Songhua the river turns northeast, now flowing towards Khabarovsk, where it joins the Usuri River and ceases to define the Russia-China border. Now the river spreads out dramatically into a braided character, flowing north-northeast through a wide valley in eastern Russia, passing Amursk and Komsomolshan Amur. The valley narrows after about 200 kilometers 120 miles and the river again flows north onto plains at the confluence with the Amgun River. Shortly after, the Amur turns sharply east and into an estuary at Nikolaisk on Amur, about 20 kilometers (12 miles) downstream of which it flows into the Strait of Tartary. Topic: <laughs> History and context. In many historical references, these two geopolitical entities are known as Outer Manchuria (Russian Manchuria) and Inner Manchuria, respectively. The Chinese province of Heilongjiang on the south bank of the river is named after it, as is the Russian Amur Oblast on the north bank. The name Black River was used by the native Manchu people and their Qing Empire of China, who regarded this river as sacred. The Amur River is an important symbol of, and geopolitical factor in, Chinese-Russian relations. The Amur was especially important in the period following the Sino-Soviet political split in the 1960s. For many centuries, the Amur Valley was populated by the Tungusic, Avenki, Solon, Dutcher, Yurchin, Nanai, Ulch, and Mongol Dor people, and near its mouth by the Nivs. For many of them, fishing in the Amur and its tributaries was the main source of their livelihood. Until the 17th century, these people were not known to the Europeans, and little known to the Han Chinese, who sometimes collectively described them as the wild Yurchins. The term Yupi Daisy fish skin Tatars, was used for the Nanais and related groups as well, owing to their traditional clothes made of fish skins. The Mongols, ruling the region as the Yuan dynasty, established a tenuous military presence on the lower Amur in the 13 to 14 th centuries. Ruins of a Yuan era temple have been excavated near the village of Tyr. During the Yongle and Zonde eras, early 15th century, the Ming dynasty reached the Amur as well in their drive to establish control over the lands adjacent to the Ming Empire to the northeast, which were later to become known as Manchuria. 
Expeditions headed by the eunuch Yixia reached Tyr several times between 1411 and the early 1430s, rebuilding twice the Yongning Temple and obtaining at least the nominal allegiance of the Lower Amur's tribes to the Ming government. Some sources report also a Chinese presence during the same period on the Middle Amur. A fort existed at Igun for about 20 years during the Yongle era on the left northwestern shore of the Amur downstream from the mouth of the Ziya River. This Ming dynasty Igun was located on the opposite bank to the later Igun that was relocated during the Qing dynasty. In any event, the Ming presence on the Amur was as short lived as it was tenuous. Soon after the end of the Yongle era, the Ming dynasty's frontiers retreated to southern Manchuria. Chinese cultural and religious influence, such as Chinese New Year, the Chinese God, Chinese motifs like the dragon, spirals, scrolls, and material goods like agriculture, husbandry, heating, iron cooking pots, silk, and cotton spread among the Amur natives like the Udagays, Ulchis, and Nanais. Russian Cossack expeditions led by Vasily Poyarkov and Yurufi Khabarov explored the Amur and its tributaries in 1643 44 and 1649 51, respectively. The Cossacks established the fort of Albazin on the Upper Amur, at the site of the former capital of the Solons. At the time, the Manchus were busy with conquering the region, but a few decades later, during the Kangxi era, they turned their attention to their North Manchurian backyard. Igun was re-established near the supposed Ming site in about 1683–84, and a military expedition was sent upstream to dislodge the Russians, whose Albazin establishment deprived the Manchu rulers from the tribute of sable pelts that the Solons and doors of the area would supply otherwise. Albazin fell during a short military campaign in 1685. The hostilities were concluded in 1689 by the Treaty of Nurchinsk, which left the entire Amur Valley, from the convergence of the Shilka and the Irgun downstream, in Chinese hands. Fedor Soymanov was sent to map the then little explored area of the Amur in 1757. He mapped the Shilka, which was partly in Chinese territory, but was turned back when he reached its confluence with the Argon. The Russian proselytization of Orthodox Christianity to the indigenous peoples along the Amur River was viewed as a threat by the Qing. The Amur region remained a relative backwater of the Qing Empire for the next century and a half, with Igun being practically the only major town on the river. Russians reappeared on the river in the mid 19th century, forcing the Manchus to yield all lands north of the river to the Russian Empire by the Treaty of Igun. Lands east of the Ussuri and the Lower Amur were acquired by Russia as well, by the Convention of Peking 1860. The acquisition of the lands on the Amur and the Ussuri was followed by the migration of Russian settlers to the region and the construction of such cities as Blagoveshensk and, later, Khabarovsk. Numerous river steamers, built in England, plied the Amur by the late 19th century. Tsar Nicholas II, then Sarevich, visited Vladivostok and then cruised up the river. Mining dredges were imported from America to work the placer gold of the river. Barge and river traffic was greatly hindered by the Civil War of 1918-22. The Soviet Reds had the Amur flotilla which patrolled the river on sequestered riverboats. In the 1930s and during the war the Japanese had their own flotilla on the river. In 1945 the Soviets again put their own flotilla on the river. The ex-German Yangtze gunboats Vaterland and Otter, on Chinese Nationalist Navy service, patrolled the Amur in the 1920s. Topic. Direction Flowing across Northeast Asia for over 4,444 kilometers 2,761 miles including its two attributaries, from the mountains of northeastern China to the Sea of Okhotsk near Nikolaisk na Amur, it drains a remarkable watershed that includes diverse landscapes of desert, steppe, tundra, and taiga, eventually emptying into the Pacific Ocean through the Strait of Tartary, where the mouth of the river faces the northern end of the island of Sakhalin. The Amur has always been closely associated with the island of Sakhalin at its mouth, and most names for the island, even in the languages of the indigenous peoples of the region, are derived from the name of the river. Sakhalin derives from a Tungusic dialectal form cognate with Manchu Sahalian, black, as in Sahalian Ula, black river, while Ainu in Japanese, Karaputo, or Karafuto, is derived from the Ainu name of the Amur or its mouth. Anton Chekhov vividly described the Amur River in writings about his journey to Sakhalin Island in 1890. 
The average annual discharge varies from 6,000 cubic meters per second cu foot per second 1980 to 12,000 cubic meters per second 420,000 cu foot per second 1957, leading to an average 9,819 cubic meters per second 346,800 cu foot per second or 310 cubic kilometers 74 cu me per year. The maximum runoff measured occurred in October 1951 with 30,700 cubic meters per second, 1,080,000 cu foot per second, whereas the minimum discharge was recorded in March 1946 with a mere 514 cubic meters per second, 18,200 cu foot per second. Topic: <inaudible> Bridges and tunnels. The first permanent bridge across the Amur, the Khabarovsk Bridge, elevation 2,590 meters (8,500 feet), was completed in 1916, allowing the trains on the Transsiberian Railway to cross the river year-round without using ferries or rail tracks on top of the river ice. In 1941, a railway tunnel was added as well. Later, a combined road and rail bridge over the Amur at Komsomolshan Amur 1975, 1,400 meters, and the road and rail Khabarovsk Bridge 1999, 3,890 meters were constructed. Topic: <laughs> Amur Bridge Project. The Amur Bridge project was proposed in 2007 by Valery Solomonovich Gurevich, the vice chairman of the Jewish Autonomous Oblast in Russia. The railway bridge over the Amur River will connect Tongjong with Nizhnilaningskoy, a village in the Jewish Autonomous Oblast. The Chinese portion of the bridge was finished in July 2016. In December 2016, work began on the Russian portion of the bridge. The bridge is expected to open in October 2019. See also Amuri, Tampere, a Tampere district named after battles at River Amur during the Russo-Japanese War Amur cork tree Amur falcon Amur leopard Amur tiger Amur honeysuckle Geography of China Geography of Russia Sino-Soviet border conflict Jilin Chemical Plant Explosions 2005 Home of the Kaluga Asapansariforms. List of longest undammed rivers 64 villages east of the Heilong Zhang Amur Military Flotilla Topic. References Bisher, Jamie 2006. White Terror, Cossack Warlords of the Trans-Siberian Routledge. ISBN 1135765952. Hoffman, Jean 2006. White Terror, Cossack Warlords of the Trans-Siberian. Routledge. ISBN 1135765962. Hoffman, Jean 2014. Forsyth, James A History of the Peoples of Siberia, Russia's North Asian Colony 1581–1990 Illustrated, reprint, revised ed. Cambridge University Press. ISBN 0521477719. Retrieved 24 April 2014. Kong, Hyeokhweon. Xiao, Jeffrey, ed. Big Heads and Buddhist Demons, The Korean Military Revolution and Northern Expeditions of 1654 and 1658." PDF. Emory Endeavors in World History 2013 ed. 4, Transnational Encounters in Asia, 1–22. Archived from the original PDF on March 2013. Retrieved 10 March 2014. Kim Jin, Loretta E. Yume Saints for Shamans? Culture, Religion and Borderland Politics in Amaria from the 17th to 19th Centuries. Central Asiatic Journal. Harisovitz Verlag. 56-169-202. JSTOR 10.13173, Centasage.56.2013.0169.
Stefan, John J. 1996. The Russian Far East, A History Illustrated, Reprint ed. Stanford University Press. ISBN 0804727015. Retrieved 24 April 2014. External links Media related to Amur River at Wikimedia Commons Amur Hailong River Basin Information Center – Maps, GIS data, environmental data Information and a map of the Amur's watershed